Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am Ms. Roxanne and this is Daily Rambles. Today we're doing Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Season 6, Episode 11 called From the Ashes. So we start off with uh, Yo-Yo uh, beat up Mac, which was really as ill. And basically we have the device that still has the energy from the monolith in it. And then we find out that Izel faked out and um, dropped the name. Basically, um, Yo-Yo was talking about all this information to Mac, and Mac was actually being possessed by Izel. So she heard Benson that might that knows everything, and so they're going to get him on the bus. Then we cut to where Shield is screaming to find the bus and that the Simmons are trying to find a solution for Zell, but they can't find anything. They're kind of stuck. Then May questions Sarge and he got mad and left an imprint of his hand on the table, which was new. Uh, then we cut to where Quake and May argue. Then Benson is on the bus and drops uh, research stuff about uh, three possible locations. Uh, and Yo-Yo subtly warns him, so he deletes the files. Uh, and so then, uh, Mac, or Zell, offed one of the people on the bus. And then we cut to where Quake questions Sarge and tells him to use the rage and taunts him. And then they go back and forth and then she can't take it and storms off. Then, uh, she, then Fitzsimmons, uh, goes to talk to her after, she, Quake goes to talk to Fitzsimmons, and basically tell her what, the best thing you can use is the sword. That's about it. And then we cut to where, uh, they round on her and basically saying that she won't listen to what Sarge has to say, and that, uh, she kind of run, runs away from difficult situations. Like when, uh, the original Coulson went on this permanent vacation, she went to space. And then when Lincoln, uh, went on a permanent vacation, she went away as well. And every other time she just kind of, uh, runs away from the problem and won't face it. But then they kind of soften it's like, look, if I'm here for you, if you need to talk to me, and that was specifically summons. Then we cut to her, um, Mac and Yo-Yo talk, and then we cut to where Zell uses the device on Benson and sees his, um, oft husband. And then we cut to where Daisy reads the letter, and then it goes to question, uh, Sarge again, and, uh, quaked his, uh, neck, um, snapped it. Then Fitzsimmons busts her out for doing that, and, um, uh, basically he's not gone, he's coming back around. And we go back to where um, Benson sees his um, oft husband and basically guilts him about pulling the plug and alluding to that he might have hit him with his car because he was uh, drinking too much. Then Izell off the, hu the husband again, which I don't understand how that actually happened, but he went to dust and everything. And she's like, we're going to do this again and again and again and again until you give me some information. So he finally gives her the information. And then we cut to where May knows about Daisy, uh, what he what she did to Sarge. And uh, now we have Sarge is awake and literally kills Daisy and then literally knocks down the wall and tries to leave. Then we cut to where Quake is using the sword. And then, um, then we cut to where Matt makes a play and it works and they manages to eject Benson. Then we cut to where Quake um, is about to use the sword on Sarge, but he said Sky. Because he's starting to remember more about Coulson's memories. So she can't do it now. And she drops it. And she goes, like, Oh, you're going to sacrifice yourself. That's what Coulson would do. And then she drops the sword and gives him a hug and kind of tears up. And then we cut to where Zell activates the device at the temple. Then Deke figured it out. And basically she's a frequency. And that's how all these stripes and everything is working. And all these monoliths is by a harmonious frequency that activates it. So that's how she manages to um, go into one thing. Because she's basically an atom. And basically 
Adam's cre um, filled the dead space. So that's how they're, she's doing what she's doing. And basically they're going, so Fitzsimmons was trying to create a sonic barrier. And then we have S.H.I.E.L.D. found Benson. So now they know how, in, in like an, a roundabout way where they are. And then we have Quake and May talk. And then we cut to where, um, like I said, they found Benson. And now, uh, basically, um, Azel activates the device. And she's going to be rebuilding the monolith. Because of their, because uh, of Max and Yuga's mind. And there's like, oh, we already faced blah 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 and we're not scared of you and all this stuff and so um and she's like well if that's true who's this person and it's flint from the last season which they kind of adopted as like their own kind of like kid so um yeah <laughs> and uh then we cut to our alta gets shut down by the hunters and now they have new targets and they're going to be doing that and that was in the episode this was a great episode. We're finally getting a lot of information and I think it's kind of interesting on how Izzel works as a frequency and I feel like that's pretty cool. Um, and it wasn't something like stupid, you know, so I actually kind of like the reasoning behind it and everything and how everything is working and how she controls her strikes and everything. So I feel like that was actually pretty neat. Um, so I give this episode overall A-. minus. Um, I thought it was a strong episode. It definitely wasn't the strongest episode, but I feel like um, next week will be great because it's the season finale, which I'm kind of sad about. And I found out that show is ending after season seven. I haven't read the news. I just haven't made any videos because I'm still dealing with stuff, feeling better, but you know, it's still taking my time. So I might be posting a little bit more throughout the week, maybe. We'll see how I feel over this weekend. And, um, yeah. And I just want to thank you for everyone who has subscribed. Um, uh, apparently I got three new ones in the past couple of days. So I got 42 now. So thank y'all so much for subscribing. I actually really appreciate it. If you wanted to subscribe, hit the button, please. And like and comment and do all the things. Um, because that's so I'm not feeling back to myself yet. Um. I'm feeling a lot better than I was two weeks ago, but it's still kind of, you know, it's still difficult. But, um, doing better, and, um, uh, I'll see you on my next video. Alright, bye everybody.